You covered me in tulip petals upon my arrival. Even before my eyes could open, you bathed me in honey, elderflower, and hazel. I came here, naked, having nothing to offer. And yet you held me in an endless embrace of gracious generosity, your arms full to the brim of gifts for me. I take a breath. My nostrils, the tiniest of entrances, become the gateway to all of existence because of you. In the smallness of my body, you offered the interminable landscapes of valley, ocean, and bog as my playground. No matter where I went, my tiny feet were always held by you. Ground, stone, soil, and dirt, even in your magnificence, you offer the humility of this bare earth. I, I'm a pauper. My hands are empty. But there is no price at your table. Your banquet is endless. Behold the majesty of your infinite giving. Child, mountain, breeze, and crop. Star and fish live alongside the vastness of your great bounty. I walk this earth with my naked skin and open mouth. You meet me with cherry trees, orange groves, and the great mystery of the tiny pomegranate seed. I grow old. And yet, not once have I received a receipt. Not once have you refused to get the bill. You take me by the hand, leading me through the open fields and desert dunes that you've made for us to dance in. We whirl and spin. And then, then I tarry. I tarry and dwell in the caves of my own confusion. I call you names in this dripping cavern of dirty lichen and unhappy mud. I sit with my back turned, mystified by the shadowy walls, enchanted by the nightmares, caught in the drum of my screaming, my yelling. I turn you into a monster and play the game of villain, arguing with crazy tongue and sunken eyes. Then, then I become tired. My voice is hoarse. I beat my clenched fists one last time and succumb deep into the slumber of pacified paroxysm. And in the quiet of sleep, in the stillness of repose, you show me that cave, lichen, fists, and tears were also a gift from you.